Hey everybody, welcome back to Land Investing Online. In this video, I'm going to show you a very simple but effective tool, adding county lines to Google Earth. Now when we're evaluating land, looking at land, Google Earth is a very powerful tool. Understanding and being able to add these overlays is very valuable when looking at land, when comparing counties, everything like that. So let's get to it. So first off, you're going to need Google Earth Pro downloaded on your computer. If you do not already have it, type into Google, download Google Earth Pro. There should be a link right there. I'll also put a link down in the description. You can see Google Earth Pro right here. This is just base. I don't have any layers. Over here, you'll see the layers that you add, and that's what we're going to do. We're going to add a county lines layer. You can add so many layers. Every layer is a KML file that would go over here, and then you can checkbox when to put it on, and we are going to go over that. So let's get over to Google. And and get the county line overlay. Okay, so we're on Google and you're gonna type in here, Google Earth County Lines. And I've tested quite a few of these overlays. I'll put the overlay in description so you don't even need to type into this and what you can go straight from there. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna scroll down and this is the one that I have got the best success for. So you can see from the National Operation operational hydrologic remote sensing center you're going to hit this one and this will automatically go to your downloads so you can see up here i have the download and what type of file so all i'm going to do is hit that and then we are going to go back to google earth okay so we're here on google earth now and we can see that this automatically so once i hit that download link it automatically shot over to my google earth and you can see all the county lines on here very valuable information and you can uncheck this overlay at any point you can have 5 10 15 overlays that you use on different sections you can add a flood zone overlay you can add all different overlays that are going to be very valuable if you're valuing land if you're doing houses anything like you can have overlays that are going to be helpful for your business so let's zoom in here the one thing this overlay does not have is names you can look for other overlays that have names but what i found when i'm adding the names when the names are added with a different overlay google earth really struggled to hold that and it went really slow it slowed down my google earth quite a bit this overlay makes google earth still running very smoothly so i'm in hamilton county ohio this is right here uh, so you can see as you zoom out you can see the counties everything like that state lines and at any point you can turn off these overlays just by checking this box. So you can see right there, I turned off all the overlay for the county lines and you can look around and it's a lot cleaner without those overlays. Like I said, it's very helpful with evaluating. Other than that, that's all I have for this video. It's a very simple but helpful tool. If you're evaluating land, if you're looking at different areas, comparing counties, whatever it is, it's a very valuable tool when you're doing that. Other than that, thank you so much for watching. If you have any other suggestions for future educational videos, please let me know in the comments below. Hit that subscribe button. Very helpful for us spreading our mission with land investing. Have a good day. We'll see you next time.